the given equation can be written as x square minus in brackets b plus c times x plus bc plus x square minus in brackets a plus c times x plus ac plus x square minus in brackets a plus b times x plus ab is equal to 0. Therefore, 3x square minus 2 times in brackets a plus b plus c times x plus ab plus ac plus bc is equal to 0. Now, the roots of this quadratic equation are real if the discriminant is greater than or equal to 0. The discriminant is equal to 4 times a plus b plus c whole square minus 4 times 3 times ab plus ac plus bc. This is equal to 4 times in brackets a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2ac plus 2bc minus 3 times in brackets ab plus ac plus bc. This is equal to 4 times in brackets a square plus b square plus c square minus ab minus ac minus bc. Now this can be rewritten as 2 times in brackets 2a square plus 2b square plus 2c square minus 2ab minus 2ac minus 2bc. This is equal to 2 times in brackets a square plus b square minus 2ab plus a square plus c square minus 2ac plus b square plus c square minus 2bc. And this is equal to 2 times in brackets a minus b whole square plus a minus c whole square plus b minus c whole square. Now notice that all three terms in the square brackets are greater than or equal to 0 and therefore their sum is also greater than or equal to 0. Therefore the discriminant of the given quadratic equation is greater than or equal to 0 which implies that the roots of this equation are real. And this is the required result.